YouTube, it's your girl Natalie, the Winter Diamond, coming at you with a morning chit chat video. This is my second time recording this. For some reason, I gotta clear this memory out because it keeps telling me I get halfway in the video, almost finished, and it just cuts me off. And I'm like, okay, okay, okay. And I almost uploaded that video. But they'll know I meant to say goodbye. But anyway, let me do this again. I started out by saying I have one more day for my birthday. I will be 46 years old. I have nothing planned. I will be working on my birthday, but it's my birthday. Okay? Just psyching myself up, y'all. It's not. It's just another day. The day that I was born, my birthday. Okay? Anyway, let's get to the not so good news, the bad news. Okay? Got on the scale this morning. 219. 219 you guys back where I started at when I was starting insanity you guys know when I weighed in the other day I was like 213 so it's like in a matter of day I can't remember the last time I weighed in I was 213 I think it was last Monday so in a week's time my scale is showing me that I am 219 so that's 6 pounds in a week and I think Three of them is probably fluid because I didn't take my blood pressure pill over the weekend. So that's two days without it. And usually when I don't take it, I gain anywhere from two to three pounds from not taking it. But I was just rushing the weekend and I didn't take time to take it. And then when I got home and thought about it, it was late. Didn't want to be up all night long using the bathroom. So it is what it is. That's what happened. So um, anyway little discouraged by that but not gonna let it stop me I will be starting that doing my insanity um, tonight and if that does my knees does not cooperate with that then I'm gonna have to come up with a different plan because I cannot I can't keep doing this I can't keep fluctuating between the same two do the same pounds lose them go back lose them go back I can't keep doing that I got to get down I've got to get in Wonderland. I mean, I have got to get back in Wonderland, so I've got to keep pushing. And you know, I told you guys I really didn't want to stop the insanity because I knew my knew my knees were bothering me and, and it was painful, and I didn't think I was working out as good as I could. But I have got to get back doing something because it's like everything I've gained, I feel like I've lost it again. And now I have to go back and start all over again. And I know I didn't get any water in. I think that's got a lot to do with it. I was just thinking, you know, in my first video, I think I might have had one cup of water. And that was a small cup of water all weekend long. And it was coffee. I haven't really even been drinking any fluids. I, I, I haven't been drinking any. I don't know why I haven't been drinking my water or my fluids. But I just haven't. So I got to concentrate on getting my water in. That is the key to weight loss, you guys, is getting your water in. Most definitely, it's a key. So, I got to get that in. I got to focus more on that. Um, and getting back into a gym or something, exercising, working out, doing something. I got to get back at it. But like I said this morning, I feel like I'm stuffed in the midsection. I just feel stuffed. I feel full. I just feel... I just feel stuffed. I feel like weight is there you know um anyway had a good weekend um on to brighter things now <laughs> i had a very good weekend everything went great you guys already know um i'm thinking today it's raining so i don't know how much i'll do but today i want to roll sally henson again i went out last night to do it at the family dollar by my house but those old ladies that work in there they really tear my nerves up because they're, they're like they're scared of coupons. Then you got to go through so much just to use a coupon. And it's a store coupon. And the old lady just kept looking at it. It was like, it's your family dollar. She said, it says $2 off of $52. I said, ma'am, it don't say that. So I said, let me see it back. And I looked. It was a dollar. So I'm like, well, I know when I get old, I'm going to want to work too still. But I'm like, let her wear her glasses or something. I mean, I said, ma'am, it says $2 off of $2. That's the money sign. And she kept looking at it and looking at it. And the other old lady who, she gives you a fit too, but she came over there. Oh, 
I can't remember what her name was. You just uh, analyze it too much. You think about it too much. Just scan the darn thing. I'm like, oh my God, they're about to fight here. Two old ladies, I'm telling you, these ladies, that they ain't in their 60s going on 70s. They were tickling me. I'm like, okay, somebody just punched the numbers in, so there it go. Then it went, it wasn't scanned for, she just started punching the numbers in. She said, that's all you got to do, $2 off, that's it right there, $2 off. And the other little old lady was kind of shaking her head at how the lady was talking to her. I'm sure she gets that out of her. And I can tell, because when I went to use a coupon there before, she kind of talked snappy that way towards me. And then she started telling me about this other lady who wanted her coupons back so she could use them at the next family dollar. And, I mean, it was this lady. She's just a trip. They are. I, I don't like the family dollar by my house. I have found friendlier service at the one by my job. So I said I will roll with the ones by my job today. Hopefully it's still rolling, okay? But what it is is Sally Hansen nail polish. It's $2. You start out paying $2. And then um, the next time you get a $2 gift, a little coupon on the end of your receipt, you use that, but you need a filler, a little cheap filler. Some people use gum. I was using stuff like the drink mixes or the seeds is what I was using. Because um, they were cheap. The seeds are like 25 cents. So you can do that or you can do the pack of gum. Stuff that you can use. Whatever you want to put in. Just to have a filler. Don't let your balance go below $2 or you won't get another $2 call. You won't get another $2 receipt. So that's what I did. Um, so that's what y'all can do, okay? Now, Procter & Gamble, let me tell y'all that real quick for, hopefully I won't cut off again. Um, Bright Aid, has, you can do the nail polish extravaganza. It's double dipping, Procter & Gamble and the nail extravaganza. You need to buy seven of the CoverGirl nail polish. Make sure you get CoverGirl because the nail extravaganza covers a lot of different polishes. But in order to double dip with P&G, you need to get the CoverGirl nail polish. Get seven of those. There's a three dollar off of two coupon, and then I think there's a dollar off of one or a two dollar off of one nail polish. Can't remember what they were saying. Look at the videos, get us and look at it again today before I went. Um, that would be best. I mean, to do that, you only can do it one time per card now, only one time. So you'll need several cards if you want to do the double dip. Now, the nail extravaganza, you can do that three times. But in order to get the double dip, you have to do. You have to have more than one card, okay? You get ten dollars back from the PNG and ten dollars back from the nail extravaganza. That's when you buy seven of the CoverGirl nail polishes using um, three of the three dollar off of two and one of the two dollar off of one. I think it is. Um, just check your P&G, check your coupon databases, they will tell you. Good, good, good deal for that. And that's what I think I'm going to do because I think it'll be cheaper for me. Because they're buy one, get one 50% off. So, and I think there, some people are saying they show $4.99. Some people say they're bringing up at $5.99. So, it'll be like $6 for one and three for the next. So, that would be cheaper for me to do that. Because I have no up rewards because I burn them all on the dream lights. Plus, I used them all on the food stuff last week. So, I'm starting over fresh this week. So, I think I'm going to do the CoverGirl nail polish. I think that would be cheaper. Now, if some of you are trying to finish up the um, mail-in rebate that Procter & Gamble had, because you have to buy everything by tomorrow, my birthday, April the 30th, the last day to purchase stuff. Um, they have the Natural Instinct coupon in the Procter & Gamble. You buy Natural Instinct, and you'll get the Pantene shampoo for free and the Pantene shampoo was one of the items listed up there I don't know if you can use it by you getting it free I don't know if it'll do that or not for it so you just need to read that PNG's um you need to read the PNG really good just to make sure because I'm not sure if it will y'all know what I'm trying to say read the PNG um rebate to make sure that the item you can use it if it's free for you okay so um anyway that's all i had to say today guys um not really much i can't remember if i even what i said in the other video because y'all know i talk so much I'm trying to remember make sure i tell y'all everything um i haven't really checked any of the other stores out i haven't really heard anybody really talking about walgreens i think after saturday's double dip i think everybody's kind of tired of walgreens they've kind of burnt themselves out they've done a walgreens burnout um CVS, not too sure what's going on at CVS either. I haven't really looked at too much. Um, looked at some videos, but I can't even remember what people are getting. I think Target was the big thing with getting those um, 
combined packages, three toothpastes, and I think it was like four of the Oral V toothbrushes, I think is what it is. $5.99, get the $5 gift card. It was a misprint, so I know some of the targets was honoring it. I didn't um, even go out last night to try it to see if I could do it, so I'm not sure, you guys. So um, I'm not sure if it's still if they're still going to honor it today or not, or if they're going to have signs printed out. Probably they'll have signs hanging up saying that it's not part of the deal so that they don't have to honor it. I'm sure they had to honor it yesterday, but I don't think they, I don't know. I don't know. Go try. Your mileage may vary. Anyway, you guys have a wonderful, blessed day. Remember to give God some praise. Thank him for waking you up, starting you on your day, and I will see you guys in the next video. Okay? Bye.